Well, uh, somewhere underneath all them carrots, potatoes, and onions is a huge roast. I'm fixing to put this in my solar oven. All right, we're in there. This thing uh, heated up to uh, about 100 and... There's no way I can... Here, I put my shadow on. About 165 degrees before I put this in here. And that's with, uh, oh, about 9 a.m., 9.30 sun. Uh, I'm going to come out about every hour and re-aim this. And I'm thinking five or six hours, and I, I should have cooked roast. I uh, figured out a way to aim this, and aiming it is uh, the most important thing besides having insulation and reflectors. Aiming it directly at the sun is really important, so I added this right here and this shadow uh look at my shadow where i'm pointing right there tells me when i've got it aimed at the sun uh correctly and this i just got a board here and i'm holding it up sort of beside this and then look at my shadow there See, the sun adds 10 pounds, you know. <laughs> so, when this is, uh, you know, at its smallest, watch. See, so I compare that angle to the angle that I have the oven, and that's how I get the, uh, the angle right. I'm up to 200 degrees in uh, one hour. Don't know if you can see this because there's so much reflection. So, uh, trust me. You can trust me. It's 200 degrees. And it's uh, just now 10 o'clock, so for the next four hours, the sun is going to be at its highest and hottest. So uh, I just keep an eye on it, and it's uh, working good. It's uh, 11 a.m., and it's at 225. I'll check it in one more hour. I just can't wait anymore. It, it's been there uh, four hours, hovering between 225 and 250. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and take it out, bring it in the kitchen, open it up, and let's have a look see. Uh, it's been a cloudy day. The clouds have been coming and going all day long. Uh, I w really expected this thing to get up a little higher than that, but when I get the uh, corners in and, and the mylar for, uh, reflectors I have no doubt in my mind this thing will get well into the 300s so uh, I'm gonna take this out and bring it in well uh, I may not be the smartest guy in the world but you can count on me being honest what we're looking at is the, uh, the roast in the oven I, I only got that thing up to 250 at its highest and uh, you know the clouds it was scattered clouds today it was or partly cloudy sorry I'm not a weatherman anyway I'm disappointed really disappointed I, I know I can get this thing up into the 300s I'm a hundred percent positive I can but not today too many clouds and uh, I don't have the proper reflective material uh, I did boil water yesterday that was pretty awesome and uh, today I got it up to 250 with uh, more careful aiming but when I replace those reflectors with mylar I'll do another video I'm gonna put this video up just in case anybody's been waiting to see you know how I can cook on it but uh, the roast wasn't done I've got it in here I'm gonna stick it in here for an hour at 400 degrees just to finish it off if I had uh, another couple of hours of Sun this would have been done the onions were done the potatoes were done carrots were done but the meat was a little too rare for my wife so uh, there you have it and thanks for following this and uh, it's probably going to be oh beginning of summer before I get around to uh, getting another solar cooking video up take care y'all